Hello, Internet! I am back, Beltheria that is, with some more Pokemon Sapphire version by Nintendo and Game Freak. And today we are going to, you know, shore up our good deeds. See what's happened to people. Um, because last time we beat that one guy, and, uh, the, oh, oh, my mouse pointer's on screen. That's not good. Get that off of there. Uh, alright, and, uh, this guy used to be blocking the door to this place, and he can get back to work now, is basically all he's saying. And there's some people in here. What do you have to say for yourself? To get to Verdenturf without using this tunnel, you'd have to cross the sea to Duford, sail on to Slateport, then travel through to Morville. Like, that, that's quite the distance. <laughs> How about you? That Rustburf tunnel there, at first we had a huge crew boring through the rock with the latest machinery, but we had to stop. Turns out, we had to have a negative effect on the wild Pokemon in the area. So we've got nothing to do but all around here doing nothing. There's a man digging his way to Verdant Turf all by his lonesome. He's desperate to get through. He says that if he digs little by little without using machines, he won't disturb the Pokemon. And he'll avoid harming the natural environment. Oh, okay. So he's just lifting rocks. Cool story, brother. Okay. Don't know why all of them were speaking in a really bad Australian accent. That's strange. Maybe they're all from Pokemon Australia, where everyone speaks with a really bad Australian accent. Hey, don't laugh, Internet. This game and a bunch of its others take place in, like, Pokemon Japan. Uh, it wasn't until a couple of generations they started stretching out. The newest games actually take place in Pokemon France. Ugh. Hey, guy. Find your thing. Yep. Yep. Got him back. Well, yes. Okay. Look. I'm good. I'm not great. I'm good. I am experienced. Oh, hey. A great ball for a great trainer. Yeah, I... I get the joke, guy. I'll just... I'll just put that back in my bag with all the other things I'm not gonna use. Oh! Flash forward. Devon Corporation's third floor. President. Uh-huh. Could I get you to deliver it to the... Oh, I knew this was gonna become a whole thing. Ugh... The life of an adventurer. Always getting roped into a new... New job. Oh, buddy, 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 buddy. What? What are you doing? The president would like to have a word. Good. I want to talk to this guy. I want to get you fired. Shelling your job off onto me. It's like, hey, this loser will do it. Mr. Stone, nice to meet you. How you doing? Yeah, you know, a lot of people do. I'm a pretty swell guy. Yeah, twice. Neither of which by my own deal. I guess one of them was. The other guy, this guy, actually hid behind me. I am a child, and he hid behind me. I guess we've established that in my version of the Pokemon world. I am not a child. I am, in fact, me. Um, I have a favor to ask of an amazing person. I understand you're delivering... Uh... You told him I would do it before you told... Before you asked me? Oh, uh, you are a colossal ass. Okay, Mr. CEO, President of Devon Bullshit, what do you want? Stop off in Duford Town. Well, there is a gym there, so I am going there anyway. Letter to Stephen in Duford. Um... Sure... Okay, I can do that. Why not? I'm already one person's bitch boy. Ugh. I am a great president. Uh, uh I mean, you, you know, you know Taft, but I mean, you seem okay. I mean, you got a mustache, so you got that going for you. Oh, thank goodness! You're actually going to pay me for this with a what's it? It's a Pokemon Navigator 
indispensable tool. Has a map of the Hoenn region. Sweet. Well, yeah, I really need to reset my controls. Okay, anyway. Uh, yeah, we now have access to the PokéNav, which uh, serves a number of functions. One, we can look at our world map. We are here. We need to get here. A little island. But we don't have the ability to swim. So, whatever shall we do? If only there was some sailor who owed us a favor and lived right about exactly here. Right there. Right there, actually. Right here. Is there, is there a guy? I don't know. There might be. <laughs> Another option available to us is we can look at our Pokemon's contest stats. How good they are at the different contests. Like, how their base stat is. Um... All of ours are neutral. They do not have any training in any contest stat. And they never will. <laughs> and then we can uh, we can organize them by stat. And we can do this. We can talk to people, sort of. Basically, we have a contacts list. And sometimes, very rarely, some of these people will call us for a rematch. Never any of the gym leaders, you know, the people who would actually be useful to fight again. But, um, you know, whatever. You, you do not deserve this position. Captain Stern, yeah, I know, I already have your package. You, ugh. This guy. Okay, well, we're in the building now, which means we have to search every trash can for free stuff. That's a Pokenav! Came about as a result of our president's desire to learn about the feelings of Pokemon. Uh oh. Okay. How about you? New Pokeballs! Haven't made much headway. Well, you will. Device for talking with Pokemon. Haven't had any success. Um. Trying to develop a device that visually reproduces the dreams of Pokemon. But it's not going well. Wait a minute. Talking with Pokemon. Oh my god, I never noticed this before, but... Oh, goodness. <laughs> These two guys are working on things that came about in later generations. Like, I knew there were rumors about them having developed them for earlier ones, but, like, there wasn't the programming space. But this is really cool. Like, uh, this guy here, uh, trying to develop a device that visually reproduces the dreams of Pokemon. They do that in Generation 5 in black and white. They have a function for that. Or they had a function before they're, they cut out, you know, internet support for it. So, yeah. <laughs> That's actually really cool. Nice. Uh, hey, guy. Hi there, I'm always welcome. Sweet deal. How about you? Yep. Sounds like they've recovered the ripped off Devon goods. Well, yeah, they. They've done it. They recovered the goods. Jerk. Anyway, enough of that nonsense. Let's move forward! Moving forward now. Uh oh. Let's go heal up. Healing up at the Pokemon Center now. Let's just fast forward through that. There we go. Okay. Looks like we have a fight with May on our hands because this girl does not get it through her head that, you know, you can be friends with people without punching their dog in the face. Ugh. Hi, May. How are you doing? You know, not good. I've not really been bothering much with it. Yeah, pretty decent, huh? Edelberg. Sweet. Is that... Do I not fight you here? Ask Mr. Briny in Pedalberg Gym in Pedalberg Woods. Okay, well, cool. Um... I mean, I thought... 
I guess I'm, uh, oh, I'm the jerk here. Oh my god, I'm the jerk here. Oh, oh, by the way, you know, sorry about, you know, dissing you on those five Pokeballs. Like, I thought you just gave me one, and like, yeah, that's a jerk move in the first place. You give me something, and I, I just scoff at it, but like, you know, I, I underestimated the gift for starters, and... Uh, yeah, 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 you passed him. That's, that's great. I, I thought we fought here. Well... Um, goodbye. Just gonna leave then, I, I guess. Oh, you know what? There was a tree to cut somewhere on this route. Where was it? It was down and to the right, I believe, actually, now that I think about it. Ah, come on. This tree looks like it can be cut. Yes, I want to cut it. I want to cut the tree. Cut the tree for me. Oh, uh, I wish I hadn't bothered to cut the tree. Okay, well, let's get to Mr. Briny's shack. Huh? Eh? Get to Briny's shack? Maybe we can, uh... Oh, yeah, we gotta explore Petalburg yet. There's all these cut trees. Tree cuts. Henrietta! You came and you cut that tree down. But there's so many zigzagoons to beat. Really? You know, if it weren't for the fact that I kind of want to catch some of the things in here, I'd, I'd basically just put on a rappel. In fact, I'm going to... Ugh, gosh dang it. Bag. I bought a rappel. Bought a couple of rappels, actually, it seems. Use rappel. Hi. Must be a trainer. Try using this item. It's a miracle seed. Oh, sweet. We can use that to power up Hector. Bag. Mm, there it is. Give to Hector, and the miracle seed will make his grass moves. I believe it's 10% stronger. Yep. Okay. Okay. Go away now. Nobody cares. About your tutorialization, they're here for me, and my tutorialization. <laughs> oh, jumping, I guess. Where am I? Am I in Bellevue? Okay, an X attack! Oh, lame. Whatever. Oh, is that it? Is that all there was to this place? I guess so. And we are out of the woods. Our pills effects wore off. Okay, well, um, you know what? I'm going to try something real quick. I would like to see if I can get a slack off in the next minute or so here. And uh, if the like first Pokemon, first like two Pokemon I come across are not a slack off, then I'm just going to leave. So here's, here's Zigzagoon, and I don't want to fight a Zigzagoon. I don't want to catch another Zigzagoon. Now... Why do I want to slack off? Two reasons. One, its final form is actually really badass. Uh, no, that's a Wurmple. Run. And two, I can trade it for a Makuhita, and a traded Makuhita will be much stronger. Uh, alternatively, I might be able to catch a Makuhita here, and that would also be pretty sweet. Um... So, yeah, you know what? This doesn't seem to be happening. Uh, we'll try one more time, and if we don't find it, then I'm just going to cut the episode, and uh, I'll come back to you when I do find a Makuhita, because I think they're pretty cool. Uh, I need a good fighting type, and they're a decent fighting type, when they evolve. When they evolve, they're pretty goddamn awesome. Okay, well, uh, one more, one more try, one more time on try, mm -hmm. try on time more once. Maybe, perhaps? Ugh. Okay. You know what? Cool story. Maybe in this patch? No. That is a Wurmple. Okay. Well, internet, that that's all I can bear. One more? <laughs> oh, that's all I can bear. One more, maybe? Oi. Taylo. I can't close my mouth. My jaw's dislocated. Kill me. Kill me. 
uh, parentheses, he was saying, kill me. And I chose not to. I leave you to writhe in agony upon the forest floor. Maybe that means we can get a slack off. Uh, okay. Nope. It's another Taylor. Alright, well, my timer has just run out. So... Uh, I will leave you here, Internet. Uh, thank you for sitting around and watching me play Pokemon. I enjoyed it. I hope you did too. Uh, if you liked it, please consider hitting the like button. And if you didn't, there's absolutely no reason to. So, yeah, it's a wonderful system. And, uh... <laughs> Alright, well, I've been Beltheria. And if you could just, you know... Stay classy, Internet. I, I, I would appreciate that because, you know... I think everybody would appreciate it. I think you'd appreciate it if you stayed classy, too. Wow, that came across as really kind of a jerk thing to say. I'm going to leave now before I shove my foot any farther down my throat. <laughs> Goodbye, Internet.